Okay. Part two of my Wonder Boy playthrough. Now let me see if I can recall where I have to go. Ah, yeah, I remember now. My mic doesn't feel like it's connected right. Like it feels too high up. But according to this little mirror I have in front of me, it seems to be positioned fine. Possibly. Oh well. So, the next stage of my journey is through a weird kind of dungeon thing, I believe. Not too hard. I think the boss is a bit easier than the last one I thought. I don't really need to worry too much about gold right now, I mean. Mm, perhaps I should have bought the spear. might make these water bits a bit easier. Oh well, oh well. Carefully. Ah, stop respawning. I chop you! I do assign a better sword though. Um, oh, this is a long dungeon, isn't it? Very long. I should have a sign somewhere. This is long, isn't it? Now, I've never noticed this before, but that fire has a very obvious light block around it. And you can see where they stuck the tile to the wall. Amateurs! Ah, oh, damn, misjudged that. Ah, oh, this is so long, I didn't realise how tediously long this was before. Back! Oh, only half my health. You do get an item later on that lets you sink underwater. Oh, you have to hit him in the head, I think. Or jab him like that. That's how you do it. You chop and then stab. I think this is just a... No, this is the actual boss. Well, wow, that was pathetic. Was that supposed to be a challenge? Because he was very easy. Stairs remind me of lemmings. Remember lemmings? It said castle, but it looks more like a palace to me. Or a civic centre. Why is that throne outside? Cheers, mate. Invisible wall! I think now I have to go left.
There's a sequel to this game, but it's not as good in my opinion. And it, oh, turns out I don't need to go left at all. Wrong. That area is where you go to the last level of the game. There's, what was I saying? There's a sequel to this game and it's not nearly as good. Did I say that? I can't remember. I can't remember what I said ten seconds ago. Hmm, this is irritating. You can jump through the stairs upwards, but not downwards. It's locked. Huh. Alright then. Oh. Wait, what? Both doors are locked, so... What? Why does it want me to go? Have I missed something somewhere? I think they all say the same thing. Oh, I'm going to try going left again, because maybe I did miss something. I tried both those doors and both were locked. One of these games where you need to talk to everyone just in case. Oh yeah, that Sphinx is easy. You don't actually fight him, you just answer his riddles. Yeah, and when you get it, you can get press the up button and go whoosh to the next part of the game. Right at the end of the game. And the last boss is ridiculous. I mean, ridiculously hard. I don't know how you beat it without save states. It, it's just... It's a joke. It, it, it's one of the hardest bosses ever of any game I've ever played. Maybe you'll get to see me get there. Oh man, these stairs are so stupid. Couldn't they just have a big ladder instead of stairs like this? Right, this door should be unlocked now. Finally, why was that not the case before? Oh, I don't want to go that way yet. Not without the special shoes! I don't need to worry about the inn for now. Can I afford anything? I think they're extremely expensive in here, aren't they? That's the knight sword. Huh, it costs 250 gold. Would you like to purchase it? Yes, thank you. It's a good sword. What about the armour? That's probably about 350, isn't it? 220 for the hard armour. No, I can't afford that right now. There's another weapon shop around here as well. Oh, hey! Yeah, yeah! Longer, you see? I think that one's locked. Yeah, you need to rescue the guy who owns it. No, where did I need to go? Was it left? No, I don't think I need to go left yet. He looks like a lemming. Item shop. Oh, these are expensive as well. Oh, no, they're not. Um, go in then. They're quite good. They make you climb ladders really quick. They're actually quite, um, they're surprisingly useful on the next part of the game because there's a lot of like vines and stuff you need to climb. Look at that! And they're really cheap as well for how useful they are. So I like them. Yeah, I need to go this way. This gets hard now. There's a lot of stuff. I only wish I'd had enough money to buy the armour, it would have made it even easier. 
Oh, they give you a lot of money, especially compared to the mushrooms. Said the armor was 250, didn't it? I like the way he climbs vines, it looks funny. The boss here is pretty tough. Well, it's more like boss is, because it's lots of people at once. I'm getting to a part of the game I never got past when I was younger. No idea why, maybe I didn't have the right... I don't know. Damn you, ghost! It appeared out of nowhere. That potion I've got on me is not that useful either, I think it only heals one heart. I love this music. This would be a lot more difficult if I only had the Gradius. Gladius? It calls it a Gradius, I think it's a typo. It should be Gladius. Shouldn't it? I should know that of all people. I studied history. Because that's why they call them gladiators, isn't it? Because of the gladiator. I don't know. Maybe it's Grad. I, I have to look that up. That's bothering me now. Gladius or Gradius? Fairly sure it's a localization error. When I finish this part of the game, on that, that part three, I'll let you all know about it. Remember? too bad, but then that wasn't the part of the game I need to do. What are you to do? Leave everything to me, that's what you're to do. Let's see, yeah, he's got some decent armour. In... That's a steel armour, it costs 800 gold, wow! Later on in the game you get, like, more gold than that just from one enemy. <laughs> Shell shield. quite have the funds right now. If I can afford a decent elixir or something, if you've got anything like that. What's this? Marine boots. They're good. What's this here? Potion. It costs 50 gold. Would you like to purchase it? No thank you. I've already got one. I don't think you can have more than one. Oh, that's a different one. No, I'll leave it, thanks. What's this thing here? Oh, that's magic. That is a really useful magic against the last boss. That will save your ass. <laughs> it protects you against stuff. Alright, fair enough. I understand. I'll get him back for you, mate. Hmm. Trying to decide if this is racist or not. I don't think they are racist. They are simply native people whose skin happens to be brown. Not racist. They don't really represent any kind of racial stereotype, do they? I mean, just because their skin's brown and... Maybe I'm... Oh, I'll, I'll stop talking. This is typical, you got to fight a load of them. Ugh. Ugh. Oh crap! Oh come on! You want me to actually use it in battle? And that's all it does? Oh god, where did I... What happens now? Is it... What? Oh no! Oh, that means I have to start all the way back at... Oh, I should have used the inn! Oh, I should have saved it! Oh my god! Oh crap! Alright, I'm going to have to get back there off camera. Ah, oh, that was a bloody waste of part two, wasn't it? Oh, I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry. Part three will be um, continuing from that boss fight, alright? I'm sorry.